Welcome to Okuma's How To. My name is Jürgen Gläser. I'm the product manager of the OSP, and today I would like to introduce our control to you. The OSP control is a very open CNC control. It is based on a Windows operating system parallel with a real time operating system that is self made by Okuma. The real time operating system is running the CNC control and the PLC control. Separating that from the Windows system makes it possible to have 100% control about the machine tool even when Windows has a problem. By that we ensure a safe production. This communication between the Windows side on the one side, which is responsible for the user interface, and the CNC and PLC side on the opposite side is done by an API. This API is an application programming interface that realizes the communication between Windows and real-time operating system. As we are saying that this is an open CNC controller, we open this API also for end users. On the OSP suite, you can install your own apps, maybe from the Okuma App Store, or you could also produce your own apps by writing code by yourself using our API interface. That makes the control very comfortable and it is a very open CNC for any kind of automation task. Using this API allows, for example, to read almost every data that you can see in the screen on the HMI and also to write many parameters and to execute functionality on the CNC control. You could, for example, select the main program using the API. This is a test application showing the functionality of the API, which is delivered together with the API. Even the source code is delivered with it, so you can easily learn what function is behind this button, for example, to select the main program. With this functionality, you can realize an automation task where a robot is loading the machine and you want to write your own control software for your automation cell. And Selecting main programs, sub-programs and executing stuff on the machine is available by using this API. As I mentioned before, the API is also available for end users. That means you can write your own applications. So we can make, we can offer a service that Okuma writes applications for you, for example, for transferring tool data from a special device or doing any kind of other automation. The API opens the possibility to develop your own applications because we offer it to customers. You can, for example, communicate with the zero offset table. You can write and read tool offsets. You can select programs and other things. And companies like Bloom and Redishaw have used this API to make user interfaces to use their equipment on our machine very comfortably. These are also available in our App Store. And we here at Okuma Europe use the API for realizing functionalities that are not available from Okuma Japan. Doing so, we can really make some user special operations and applications. We can, for example, communicate directly with the NC program and peripheral equipment using the API by just simply using a communication with variables. So we can have a kind of handshake, that means some external equipment can execute something. Then with the API, you can set some variable which is monitored by the NC program and the NC program will continue its operation after the external equipment has finished its operation. This makes the Okuma control a very open CNC control that is adjustable to all tasks that users might have. Thank you for your attention. Please see our other videos on our social media channels and on YouTube. And if you have any questions, please contact us at info at